Hey, good afternoon, Sam. My name is Noel Walton from Infinite Dream SEO. I am a local, uh, soon to be retired veteran here uh, at Fort Hood. And uh, I'm making this video, just want to show you three things that you can do today to help bring in more customers to your business from Google listings. So most likely you're sitting there and you're asking yourself, why would I be doing this and what's in it for me? I mean, I understand like most local business owners are too busy running their business, growing their business to take the time to dig into how the internet can benefit them and their company. And sometimes their only hesitation to hiring someone is they just don't know who's an expert and who isn't. So I found that by giving people an easy free attack plan of actual things they can do that will have a, a great impact on their business. Um, I've had a lot of business owners come back to me and say, Hey, no, I really like this and I like you. So can you please do this for me? Uh, so, you know, if by the end of this video, you see the value in it and uh, you, you'd like to discuss, you know, we can get on a, a call and chat, or if at the end of this video, you simply just want to take this free attack plan and do it by yourself. Absolutely fine as well. So let me uh, get right to it. I know your time is valuable. So the first of the three things is going to be content. Okay. So 1500 words is what Google's going to view as a fully optimized website. So 1500 words on your front page with relevant keywords. So I'll show you an example of that. So here's your site, A and B Electric, uh, one of your top competitors here, Amped Up Electric, and uh, kind of looked at that through, you know, electricians in clean Texas. So that's the search. And I try to go off of what a buyer intent search is going to be. What are people searching for? That's going to be pretty common. Um, so obviously you can tell top ones, Yelp, Angie, Yellow Pages, all of those, um, you know, they're not they, they, you know, you do want to compete with those, but they aren't necessarily your, uh, you know, private businesses. So you're eighth next to all of those. So out of private listings, you know, uh, uh, specific company listings, that's where you're at. Um, I pulled up amped up because they show up first here in the Google map pack in the, in the map, uh, Google, my business section. And what I've done is, uh, I look at this, use this free site or free Chrome extensions. It's called SEO quake. And uh, that's going to give you a lot of information. You can actually download and look at it if you want. Um, so you have 1,168 words, which is not bad, uh, but you know, 1,500 is, should be a good goal for you. Amped Up has 1,363. So, you, you know, you guys aren't too far apart on that. Um, but, you know, keywords are important, obviously, and, and will determine what types of searches you show up in. So, uh, you know, look at, you know, what they have here, you know, electrical services, your electrical, um, lighting installation, lighting upgrades, things like that. You want to obviously keep things that are very relevant to what you do. Um, and you can see here, you've got services, electrical, commercial service, residential quality, uh, all great stuff. Um, so that's that, um, that that's the, you know, overall on the content. So the second part of this is going to be citations. Citations are just your business name, address, and phone number. And you want that as many listings as you can get online. Um, one, what actually shows or what that helps the, the most is your optimization as far as the Google map pack. So amped up is really at the top here, the you know, CWS, Dean electric air conditioning. They're all showing up here in the top of the, the map pack section. So. Part of that is the you know overall optimization of the site plus their citations. Uh, if I go here, this is a site that I use a tool called WhiteSpark. This is a paid tool. What this tells you is they have 26 citations. You guys have 20. So they've got you beat by six citations. Not hard at all to beat. Um, absolutely, I can get you there. So that's, uh, that's the citations piece. The third part of what we want to look at is the backlinks. Okay, so this is what we call link juice. What a backlink is, all, it's very simple. Some other site has your link on there that points back to your site. So that gives you more credibility to Google. So what I'll do to show you that, and this is another site I use called Ahrefs. And this tells you how many backlinks, uh, and I can click on and see, you know, and this is how many domains have those links. Um, that you have 36, uh, they have 110. So that's going to cause amped up to um, generally rank better, um, you know, be more optimized on Google. 
Um, there, there are other factors, but, um, you know, that's a lot of it. They have 81 keywords total. You guys have 66. So they beat you out on keywords as well as backlinks. Uh, so, you know, all of that obviously is not just the number of backlinks, but the relevancy of those backlinks. So, for example, you don't want Pizza Hut linking back to your website because it, that would just not give you any credibility to Google. You guys don't sling pizzas. All right. Yeah, got it. So uh, you want you want to have backlinks that are very relevant to what you guys do. So three best electricians in clean Texas. That's a great one to have right there. Um, just an example. Anything to do with the ele electricians or specific services that you guys provide. Those are going to be the best. Um, so that is it in a nutshell. And, um, you know, went over yours versus your competitor's site. So in closing, you know, just the content, make it your goal to hit 1500 words, uh, you know, really continue building relevant keywords, what you want to be searched for, uh, citations, uh, citations, really. I mean, you can, you can absolutely shoot for 100, 200 citations, beat your competition out by a landslide. The link juice or otherwise known as backlinks, uh, you know, making sure you have relevant sites that point back to you guys and show Google that you are an authoritative site. So if you implement these strategies, you know, you, you will get up in that number one across Google and, you know, you can even beat out some of these like yellow pages and Yelp and it takes time, uh, it takes some effort and all to build to that level, uh, but absolutely doable. So you're probably wondering what now? Well, you can either go with this information I provided and do it on your own. Totally cool with that. Or if you want the most effective route and you want to save yourself some time, uh, give me a call. Um, once again, my name is Noel and I'm at 254-435-5777. All right. Thank you so much. Hope you have a happy Thanksgiving. Take care.